Bill Hammond's Melting Moments one belongs to a pairing of works that the artist first exhibited uh, at Brook Gifford Gallery in Christchurch in 1999, uh, the year the work was painted. Uh, this being uh, the largest work of the two. The thing that sets him aside from many other major New Zealand artists is that the artist didn't prepare any drawings or preparatory sketches before he started painting. The fact that the painting was entirely conceived while he was painting it, it almost has this kind of punt sensibility where uh, he's starting with doodles, familiar forms, these compositions that end up uh, taking on their own life and uh, informing themselves. Even though it's incredibly detailed and delicate, uh, there's also this uh, viscosity to the paint and the marks and the way they're put down. The genus for the works came in the early 90s when Hammond was part of an expedition to the sub-Antarctic uh, Auckland Islands. And it was there that he first witnessed what a landscape or environment would be like without human intervention. The only really, the only life form on the Auckland Islands was bird life and uh, trees and vegetation. And it was the same sort of vegetation that we see in these works of the late 1990s.